coming up, what steps we can take from becoming a victim of a disease that kills the most Americans each year. A survivor shares her story. And later. Welcome back. Today kicks off a month of awareness when it comes to heart health. It's American Heart Month, and heart disease is the number one killer of both men and women in the U.S., taking more lives than all forms of cancer combined. It's amazing. Here to tell us more about the Go Red for Women campaign is spokeswoman and survivor Jennifer Maureen. Thank you so much for being with, here with us. Thank you. Now, you have a personal tie to this campaign. I do. I got involved with Go Red about um, five years ago because I had a heart attack when I was 38, and I was looking out for you know, resources and opportunities to kind of give back to the community. Your situation, we were talking, it wasn't preventable, but so often it is. Right, yeah. I, my heart attack was, um, it, it, I had something called sudden coronary artery dissection, or SCAD, which is a tear in the arteries in the heart, and um, that that is, you know, it's not very well known about right. yet, but it's being studied. and. Um, um, but about 80% of heart disease can be prevented if, if we, you know, eat right, if we move, Just take if we manage our stress. Just take these common sense steps mm -hmm. that life gets so busy, but we have to make it a priority. And that's what this month is all about, It's remembering that. And you have on your red. I do. A couple <laughs> days early, right? Right, right. Fr uh, Friday is uh, Wear Red Day uh -huh. uh, nationally. So um, the Heart Association encourages all of us to wear red as a... Um, symbol of heart disease awareness for for both women and men like you said um, heart disease kills um, more women and men than any other you know it's easy to forget that and not realize mm -hmm. it and when you hear those stats it's unbelievable right right and I'm sure you meet people all the time who once they know that you had this background you realize that they have you know, the chances for heart disease in their background and it just adds up Right, yeah, most people um, do have a story of their mother, their uncle, their father, and a lot of people have stories of their parents um, having heart attacks young, right. you know, 38, 42, things like that. Another event's coming up at the Mall of America. Tell us about that before we go. Right, next Saturday, um, which I believe is February 7th, is a free um, heart um, awareness health fair at the Mall of America. There will be blood pressure screenings, CPR training. There's a fashion show, which is gotcha. lovely. Yes. And um, it's all day, 10 to 3.30, I believe. Um, so we encourage everybody to just stop by. There's something for everyone. You'll be shopping anyhow. So Friday, wear your red. <laughs> right. And then Saturday, go get some information at the Mall of America. Exactly. And yes. learn how to better your health and prevent this. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for being here with us. Thank we you. We appreciate it. And we have more information about this at KSTV.com, Tom. All right, ladies. Thank you. Some Minnesota.